Hey everybody, Uncle here with my review for Princess Principle Episode 1. Now, uh, this is one I'm going back. I've got to review Episodes 1 and 2 to uh, catch up before reviewing Episode 3, hopefully on Sunday. Um, so, yeah, I just... I saw the first episode of most series, and out of all of them, this is one that just looked really the most promising and interesting to me, and, like, it was just so good and had so much potential that uh, I really wanted to review it week to week. So, um, yeah, I guess that's about it. I think the character designs look amazing. Uh, the setting is great. The production quality is really, really awesome. Um, so, yeah, let's go through part by part and discuss this a little bit. Uh, so starting off, we get the uh, sort of um, exposition dump for what the world is like. Uh, the Kingdom of Albion is a great empire that was split into the east and west ten years ago by revolution. Um, the We then get the opening. The opening's really probably the most catchy this season. The opening's so good. Um, one character I love, Ange or Angie, either way, Ange, either way. Um, gosh, she is freaking badass. So cool. I love her design and just her character in general. All of her Black Lizard Planet jokes. Um, I, I love it. Um, then uh, the Caverite scene when she's rescuing the guy that was running through the alley. Eric, I believe was his name. Uh, the Caverite flight and the way that that was shot and the different angles and stuff they used, it looked really, really good anim or really, really good when it was animated. Um, and uh, the lolly ninja tearing apart the cars as well. Uh, they are spies from the West, they say, which is the Commonwealth, apparently. And uh, the chase scene, again, very, very nice. Then back at the Queen's Mayfair Academy, we get introduced to the princess, who is also a spy. Um, the guy, Eric, only asks for, or he asks for his sister to go across the wall with him. Uh, so then, uh, I love the city design when, um, the voice lolly, I don't remember her name other than voice lolly, when her and uh, Anj go down into the city, I just, the design and the way the city looks and also the one scene where they're on the car on the overpass, uh, both of those, the design for the world just looks so cool. Uh, so they go to this infirmary, Anj fucking injects a bitch, she just puts this chick to sleep, like, that was great. That was one of the moments that made me like really, really like this because I was like, "Oh my gosh!" Just this background kind of scene of her injecting this chick. It's um, I I loved it. Uh, apparently, the sister Amy is suffering from caverite poisoning. Still cute though, um, and needs money for an operation. So Anj then goes to the insurance office, literally getting insurance for their plan. Um, Eric says he's defecting for the money. And he suspects that the accident that gave his sister the poisoning was no accident. Uh, we see Anj talking a little bit about her sad past, if she isn't lying, that is. And I love just the line where she's like, don't worry about me, that was back at the Black Lizard Planet. I, that was so cool. I really, really like that. Uh, but then Eric sends out a pigeon. I really didn't want him to be a bad guy like this, but yeah, he was kind of a... I mean, he didn't really have much of a choice, I guess, in the whole scheme of things, but uh, the pigeon gets intercepted by the uh, girls, of course, and uh, apparently he was working with the Duke of Normandy. The Duke of Normandy was the one that promised him the money. Uh, so, badass Chisei ninja shit in the bad guy hideout. Then Dorothy was in the room all along, points the gun to the guy's head. Um, I forget what his name was, but they capture him. Uh, then Voice Lolly is OP. Finding out that that was her on the phone and like she can change her voice like that. Voice Lolly, incredibly OP. Uh, so then Anj gets Eric to sign the insurance papers and then uh, kills him. And the body was found a week later. Ending is nice as well. And holy damn was that show good. Uh, I just, I love that last scene. I love how everything sort of um, was woven in together. Like even from her killing him her making him sign the insurance papers, going to the insurance place. I love how it was all uh, interwoven together. I kind of hope we see Amy later on. Uh, would Amy be a villain finding out about all this, or would she join them? That is a crazy thing, but I, I, I kind of hope we do see Amy later on. Um, 
So, uh, yeah, she's getting her surgery, it looks like. But either way, amazing animation. Some of the best this season for the new shows. Uh, the emotion was really, really good at a lot of scenes. The pacing of the episode was great. The music was great. The direction, I loved especially the uh, different shots they took with the Caverite flying. And uh, the combat, uh, kind of, I guess, I don't know if combat's the right word. Action sequences. Um, yeah, all of that was just great. And especially the world. Uh, a good world can make or break a series, and man, it is just so cool. Um, so yeah, I thought this was really, really good. Not going to quite give it a perfect score. Uh, I'm going to give it 9 lies out of 10. Man, this is just such a good show. And I'm looking forward to uh, catching up, reviewing the second episode, then uh, the third, of course. So um, have that to look forward to. Thank you uh, for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. So um, I guess like if you did like the video. Comment down there to tell me what you thought of this episode, what you're thinking of the show so far, what you thought of my thoughts on it and all that. Subscribe for more Princess Principle, much more anime and manga on the channel. Um, follow on Twitter if you want. I can try to keep you updated there and stuff for the channel. And um, also, if you want to uh, talk in the Discord server, then um, yeah, we got a good few people there now. Uh, probably like 15 to 20. Um, so yeah, if you want to link to that, just ask me and I will... Um, I will give you a link to it. Yeah, ask me in the comments if you want a link and I'll give you one. I don't know if I messed that sentence up at the beginning or not. Either way, that's it. Thank you so much once again for watching and I'll see you all next time.